What do you say, Fight Club? Now it is time for our main event of the evening! These are two of the absolute fucking best. They've been doing these roast shows for years. Two of the funniest fucking people in New York City, so I need all the energy you have one more time. Are you ready for your main event? Yeah! Meet them now. Introducing first, he brought his girlfriend here tonight, which isn't easy. It takes a lot to blow her up like that. Give it up for Bobby Sheehan! <laughs> And his opponent, he looks like a rabbi who showers with the kids, Ilya Laxon! Have, have you ever smelled Jewish kids? They need a couple showers. <laughs> Famously, they once took a bunch together. Uh, hey, hey, hey! Uh, uh, allegedly! <laughs> <laughs> All right. All right. This fight's going to be a three round battle. Me four jokes tit for tat in round one, four jokes straight through in round two, batch of tit for tat in round three. We'll go to our judges for feedback in between each round, but we'll pick a winner at the end of all three rounds. So in round one, Ilya, Bobby, which one of you guys wants to go first? I would like to go first, please. Bobby's going first, Ilya's going second. Fight Club, two of the fucking best, our main event, all the energy you have. Bobby versus Ilya, you ready for this fight? Yeah. One more time, are you ready for this fight? Yeah. Four jokes, tip for tat, starting with Bobby. This main event starts now. Round one, fight. All right, you guys might recognize Ilya from Guy That Was Cut Off at the Cruise Buffet. He's also pretty popular online. You can see his videos at www.asiantoiletcams.com. It's dot HK for Hong Kong. Um, Bobby, uh, Bobby looks like every kid whose mom had them when she was in her 40s. Yeah, there was a lot of drugs involved, but I think it was worth it, right guys? Hell yeah. Uh, Ilya, it's good to see you. Uh, I know COVID was hard on you. You had to start washing your hands. Excellent! Yay! Ilya is pretty gross. Like, I asked him how often he cleans his sheets, and he said, before every meeting. Thank you. That was a surprising slow burn on that one. Uh, Bobby, you cancerous leprechaun. Uh, Bobby used to be an alcoholic. I'm going to go out on a limb and say your mom drank too. It's All hard right. for me to talk about, but it made me the man I am today. Uh, guys, Elia is a Jew. That's right, he's both culturally and religiously wrong. <laughs> and uh, several times he's been on birthright, which is what he calls eating his mom's pussy. My mom has that good pussy. I don't know what to tell you guys. I agree. Uh, thank you. Thank you. We, we did it together. Bobby, you look like a ghost that haunts 4chan. Um, here's the thing. I know, like, Bobby is, like, an alcoholic and Irish and, like, wow. What else are you going to tell me? You have a small dick, gross orange hair, and a weird potato face? <laughs> that is what I was going to tell you, but I, I guess everybody could know. Uh, <laughs> Ilya thinks he'll be successful because he has that it factor, meaning he kills children while dressed as a clown. Another one. Yeah, yeah. no, you already told them I'm Jewish. They know what we do. Uh, Bobby, you look like the special needs equipment manager for a high school football team who gets to go out and score a touchdown at the end of the season. Is he retired? Huh? Was he was Rudy retarded? I didn't watch the movie. <laughs> so yes, okay. Okay. <laughs> we couldn't Fight Club, right. give it up for Bobby and Ilya. <laughs> Go to our judges. You don't have to pick a winner yet. You can just say what you think so far. Nick, we'll start with you. How do you feel after round one of this main event? I, you guys are both really good writers. Uh, Bobby did make a point to go after the Jewish cabal, and I think. <laughs> 
I think the best comedy has a point and a purpose, so right now I'm leaning towards Bobby. Modern day Bill Hicks, Bobby Sheehan. <laughs> Eric Marino, what do you think? Yeah, you are lit up like an evil little leprechaun right now. It is like, I gotta tell you, I mean, it is all you right now. You are, uh, it is evil and you are in hell. It is weird. It's just two different kids' drawings of Chucky facing each other right now. <laughs> <laughs> Brendan Sagala, what do you think after round one? Uh, I Ilya, do you use your real name with this? Yeah, why? Because you told me you were like a lawyer before this. Yeah, yeah. Aren't you afraid? <laughs> That they're going to be like, why is this guy saying Jew all the time? But I am Jewish. I'm allowed to say it, right? Uh, a little technicality, huh? Yeah, that's how technicalities work. Yeah. <laughs> Shut the fuck up! <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> Shut the fuck up! <laughs> lawyer! 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 All right. I'm giving it to Bobby, but... I'm also double giving it to Bobby. <laughs> Fair enough. You're double everything. I get it. Aaliyah Janine, what do you think? <laughs> I like the birthright joke. Um, you both terrify me, but I'm going to give it to Bobby. All right, Fight Club. That means we are going to round two of our main event right now. It's going to be four jokes straight through, starting with Ilya this time. Are you ready for the second round of this main event? <laughs> Four jokes starting with Ilya. Round two starts now. Um, I don't know if I mentioned this. I, I don't know if I mentioned this, but Bobby used to be an alcoholic. Uh, it's got to be hard to stay away from alcohol when your day job is being the worm inside a bottle of tequila. <laughs> Bobby, you look like something you find in a Wuhan wet market. Bobby, you ginger tadpole. Uh... I don't know how old Bobby is, but you look like you've lived much longer than a team of doctors thought you would when you were born. <laughs> Bobby's what you get when a black albino rapes a box of Lucky Charms. Holy shit! Holy shit! Holy shit! Bobby Hell yeah, dude. Uh, Ilya's wife is uh, Indian. When they met, she said, I hope you don't mind. My pussy tastes like curry. Ilya replied, Ew, pussy. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, give it up for the elastic waistband. We're a person. Yeah, Ilya is a lawyer. He's an immigration lawyer. Uh, he became one because he knows how it feels to be told, There's no way I'm letting you inside. And another one. Ilya supports Stop Asian Hate because he thinks it keeps Thai lady boys from calling the police. <laughs> and uh, lastly, uh, uh, Ilya hates J.K. Rowling. He says he's tired of women making up stories. <laughs> Woo! Fight Club, give it up for Bobby and Ilya! <laughs> Sorry, Bobby, I feel like you told the truth a little too much with that last joke there. That's... Go to our judge, Aaliyah Janine. We'll start with you. How do you feel after round two of this main event? I love lady boys. I'm gonna go with Bobby. <laughs> <laughs> because of the lady boy joke, or that he looks most like a lady boy in this fight? A little bit of both, okay. to be honest. <laughs> Brandon Sagalo. Dude, I'm laughing so hard just thinking about what the guys on the other side of the fence think that a bunch of white people are doing here. <laughs> <laughs> just here, like these motherfucking crackers are saying weird shit. See, Brandon, this is why I bring you to the hood, so you understand culture a little better. <laughs> That's very true. That's very true. I just bought T-Mobile. Yes. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, okay. No. Uh, Bobby, you had better jokes, and you didn't read from your phone, and I like that, and good. So good. You. Eric Marino, what like do you how, think? I like how Elliot came back in this second round. It was nice to see you get a you got a real spin together, and it was like you're a quieter guy, and I think maybe the, the fireworks were worked out just in your uh, right for you, and uh, and Bobby was overconfident and fucked up a little bit in that round, is what I feel like. Ooh. Nick Oldershaw, what do you think? I feel conflicted. I hung out with Elliot for like an hour before the show, and I was like, this guy rocks. And after listening to Bobby jokes, I'm like, damn, does Elliot suck? I don't know if I like Elliot anymore. So I think. I think I gotta go with Bobby. All right, Fight Club, it's a close fight. Two of the fucking best. We're going to round three. We're gonna pick a winner in this final round. Before jokes, tit for tat, starting with Bobby. Round three starts 
now. Final round. Fight. All right, Elia, if you're here, who's in the pool wearing their Rush t-shirt? <laughs> Who the fuck is that guy? Thank you. Elia gets depressed when he thinks about the state of the world. He, yeah, I know, that was like giving him a little taste. You guys like that I gave you a little taste, right? All right, can, can, I, t can I tell the rest of it? Okay. Yeah. Elia gets depressed when he thinks about the state of the world. He thinks, why do bad things happen to white people? I don't get it. Am I a Jew or a white supremacist? You gotta have a consistent theme. I, d I decided both as I was yeah, writing. Yeah, no, good. You're improvising. I like it. Uh, did you guys know Bobby was an alcoholic? I mentioned a couple times. Uh, we'll wait for this to pass. I live in Jersey. Is this what Dominicans are like? Is this how it works? Uh, the, they're right. Puerto Ricans. Uh, Puerto Ricans? <laughs> oh, okay. Wow, wow, Lou. I no, I just think nice. it's... Uh, no, I do think it's funny that you are an alcoholic. Like, what did you get... Like, how bad was it? Did you get drunk? Get... I'm moving... Guess what? I'm moving on to a new joke. How about that? I'm moving on to a new joke. Uh, Bobby mentioned I am an immigration lawyer. We actually have a lot in common. I work with a lot of desperate immigrants fleeing persecution who get smuggled into, U into the U.S. And Bobby looks like he lives in a shipping container. Yeah, Elia, he's a, you, uh, he's a humanitarian. I once saw him walk by a sign that said, homeless teen, give what you can. And he gave all four inches. All four inches. All four inches. All four inches. All right, yeah. He, he, he writes to me to this day, guys. You guys stay in touch. Uh... Bobby, you look like Kevin Hart in white face. <laughs> the last time I saw someone as white as you, they were covered in ash from the World Trade Center. <laughs> Take me outside, how about that? Oh man, how do you follow 9-11? That's actually what Bin Laden said. Um, <laughs> Ilya, you look like you tell women to stop smiling. They smile too much. All right, that's fair. <laughs> Bobby, you, Bobby, you fetal Irish ghost. Bobby hasn't had alcohol in three years and vitamins in 10. I sold that harder than it deserved, but it was so funny. Don't wait. Call eight. Ilya, you look like you say, come to daddy while you're eating tater tots. Thank you. Uh, you know what's weird is I was born in Russia. How come you're the one who looks like you grew up near Chernobyl? Fight Club, give it up for two of the fucking best, Bobby Sheehan and Ilya Laxon. Hey, what's up? We're gonna go to you guys first, Fight Club. Do you think the winner of this fight is Ilya Laxon? That, that pity clap thing is a loose rule, guys. You can. Uh, that is insane. Or is the winner of this fight Bobby Sheehan? <laughs> Crowd vote goes to Bobby. Nick Oldershaw, what do you think? Who do you think won this fight? Oh, it's tough. That last round, that 9-11 joke, I think was the hardest I've laughed all night. But overall, I think I got to go Bobby. Two votes for Bobby Sheehan. Eric Marino, what do you think? By the way, I just want to give it up for these guys for performing in this crazy fucking... Dude, you guys had jokes that got stepped all over, noise made, and it's like you guys killed it. And this is an insane event that just happened. Uh, you guys are both hilarious. The 9-11 joke was the fiercest, most memorable thing of the night, but it was Bobby from the beginning to end. It was just like too little, too late. But that was, I mean, you had everyone on 4th of July chanting 9-11. I mean, like, it's like, it's like there are no losers. There are no losers tonight. You got all of us here to chant 9-11 on the 4th of July. I had to be honest. Congratulations. Like, I mean, like, no, no, no. Some people win Emmys. Some people win Oscars. You, you, sir, got all of us on the 4th of July to chant 
9 yeah. 11 because he's that pale. Yeah. All right? That is how good you are. Congratulations to all of you guys. Fuck yeah. 9 11. Follow that, Brendan. Brendan Sagalo. Um. Yeah, either there are no losers tonight or quite the opposite. <laughs> How is anyone else getting home? <laughs> <laughs> We're all taking a plane. <laughs> We're taking it. Okay. I almost just said it again. Uh, Elia, you're quick, man. Your, uh, your comebacks are quick. That 9-11 joke was the best joke of the whole night, but I got to give it to Bobby again, man. All right. Bobby's got it wrapped up, but final thoughts, Elia Janine. What do you think about this fight? The 9-11 joke was great. Bobby obviously gets it. Sorry. Another vote for Bobby Fight Club. Give it up for the winner of this main event, Bobby Sheehan! Yeah!